right, all right. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy Childish. We're back at it again with the next episode of Sunday Fun Day. Y'all know what it is. So we got ourselves two guests uh, with you today. Not one, but two. We got ourselves the Motivational Gamer. What's going on? What's up, man? All right, all right. And then we got ourselves uh, all the way across the pond from Brazil. Zero bit. How you doing, baby? Yo. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So... We're getting ready to uh, hit some of that uh, Rift of Worlds action, so we went ahead and um, uh, got everybody on board. We were going to do um, a separate Sunday Funday, but given the fact that today is Thursday and, and all three of us have no lives, we're just sitting around playing this <laughs> new uh, <laughs> Ray Boss. We might as well we might as well just get it all together and do it. You know, show that show that YouTube likes to unite and and get a pop in here. So um, actually, while we're kind of setting up, do you want to? Um, do you want to send a friend request? Who wants to send a friend request? So, let's see. Yo, let me uh, let me clear some slides here first. Well, you can you can just type our names. It's all good. I guess I guess having a friend request would make it easy, huh? Yeah. All right, zero. Do you got you got room to put him on? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Send me request. Yeah, because I already I already got zero on. Don't yell at me. <laughs> All right, let me see here. What we got? Uh... All right, so, uh, yeah, just send it. Uh, it's T-Motivational G. All right. And I'll see if I can squeeze a spot. I got to... Did you send... Did you send me one or no? I gotta, I gotta add you. Team, yeah. team motivational, G. Motivation. Uh, uh, uh. No, it's just a uh, letter T and then motivational. Oh, damn, G. I can't uh, fail. <laughs> Sorry, right. I was Happened. like that my first day. <laughs> Boom. There one you go. Bank. <clears throat> All right. And Zero, you let me know when you're ready. I'm ready. Are oh, you got him added up? What? Did you got him added up? Uh, no, any, anything. Well, that's a fail, sir. You're not ready. What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm ready. Did you have him added? Uh, no, no, I don't. <laughs> oh man. All right. So while we're while all he's right. getting, you got you got it all set up. Yeah. All right. So while we're go ahead and. Uh, or we'll go ahead and set it up, um, TMG, since I know that uh, you've been doing your research on this particular one. Why don't you kind of go ahead and fill in on what you've seen so far within the Rift of Worlds and, uh, you know, maybe maybe talk a little strategy. What, what's, your, what's your thought process on it? Okay, so uh, so far, um, yeah, so after being up for like the past eight hours waiting for a release, uh, the Rift of Worlds is, is awesome. Uh, Comto has basically attempted to uh, strip away everything that we used to think worked. Um, the boss has uh, a crazy strategy. Basically, every pretty much every debuff in the book that you know makes things difficult. He stops passive effects with Oblivion. He has an AOE stun. Uh, he heals. Uh, he does everything that basically gets on your nerves. Um, and it's going to force you with your team to kind of come in and take care of everything that you need to take care of all at once. And it's going to take a little bit of organization between you and uh, you know your raid members to be effective. Uh, so you're going to need uh, specifically part, you know, one party to focus on, let's say, you know, recovery block or uh, glancing hit or attack speed reduction, etc. Uh, another party to focus on uh, other aspects that will help you guys be successful and still be efficient. Uh, immunity is going to be huge um, in this particular fight because uh, if not, then you'll get wrecked. Gotcha. <laughs> so. And what's your take on Azir? But what have you found so far? I know you've cleared upwards of uh, level four. So what do, what's your take on it so far? Well, uh, resistance leader, HP leader, and deficient defense leader are the best for this boss, at least for now. Okay. And TMG, I'm not seeing you on my list, man. Did you add me? Oh uh, yeah, yeah. I, uh, I just added you. Childish exclamation point, man. Yeah. Okay, apparently I'm blind. <laughs> I can't see you. I mean, I guess I could just... 
Let's type it out again since I can't see you right now. All right. So you said HP, HP defense and what leader was good? Resistance. Resistance. All right. Well, I don't have a... I don't have a resistance leader. I mean, I can always throw in Veramos. I don't know why I was having Chillin in there. Hold on. Mm, Veramos actually is not that good because the boss uh, lands Oblivion. So yeah. You can use the uh, passive. <laughs> yeah, he, he basically he turns Veramos into a schoolgirl. <laughs> mm. <laughs> a schoolgirl. <laughs> so, so uh, with that being said, do we do we get rid of Theo too? I mean, he's such a hard hitter. It's like what. You know, I mean, because his his oblivion, right? If you oblivion him, he's he loses his death prevention, right? Yeah. Mm, let's see. Uh, Ariel is is good uh, for the boss because she lands a lot of debuffs. Uh, Orion is good. Draco is actually good for HP leader because he has immunity, immunity, and and. ATB booster. Right. Dude, so I just I just put out a video literally like 30 minutes ago, and I still have that issue of of uh, like dragon trying to drag the people. It it always it doesn't allow me to to do it. What a pain. Yeah, I didn't even uh, I didn't get the invite, dude. Oh. Let me see. <laughs> I'm sitting here like, why haven't you joined? <laughs> yeah, I'm like watching your screen. I'm like. Uh... Yeah, see that's that's weird because I I don't know if you accept me. I would I would be able to see you on my list, right? Yeah, yeah. I just uh, I got it on my uh, home. Look at that. I already typed it. Like zero bit. Um, it says invitation sent. You should see it in your chat. Money. There you okay. go. All right. Look at that, rocking that Zyra. Oh, you can even see the your runes and stuff. That's cool. Yeah, yeah, you can yeah. see the whole setup. Everybody's team setup. Wow, that's that's gonna that's gonna be pretty darn crazy for future, um, you know, like group videos. I mean, you know that people, uh, especially the streamers and YouTubers, are gonna make gonna get you know group you know Skype sessions or whatever, and and uh, and be able to talk you know real strategy once they got their like you know three players like perfectly synced the, the way they want to or whatever. So. Yeah, for sure. That's going to take uh, some of this to a whole nother level, especially too with like with World Arena and coming. Yeah. Uh. All right. Konamiya with the cleanse, another clutch unit. You got to love her. <laughs> <laughs> I remember when I first started, I fed it like three times. I know, right? Yeah, I, I, I don't even know how many times I fed that one. <laughs> and then, funny enough, we were sitting there trying to figure out who to six-star for um, my wife's account, and uh, they're like, dude, where's your Konamiya? I'm like, uh, what? <laughs> <laughs> like, uh, that, that's good? That's good for dragons? What? No, and of course, you know, at the time, like, I had other <coughs> units that allowed me to get away from, you know, using Konamiya, but, you know, for her, it was like the perfect unit, so... Um, so I mean, this is level one. Obviously, I don't I don't know if I really need two healers or whatever. But it looks like uh, zero bits bringing seventeen healers. So maybe I should keep you know two of mine in. What do you think? <laughs> I'll do it up, man. Yeah. All right. So we'll keep it simple. We'll keep it simple. Uh, I'm ready. There we go. We're ready. Here we go. <laughs> I I ain't gonna lie. Like I'm glad that they added this in, and I'm glad. Like I think initially th people were thinking like, oh man, this kind of sucks because it's all auto and stuff like that. But I'm like, I don't know if I want to try to work with random people like like trying to actively do this. Like I can I could see somebody just being like not knowing what they're doing and then just like just failing miserably. I don't know. Yeah. No, I you know I was worried about that too, and then just seeing how the mechanics of it work. I mean, it adds a whole new element of strategy though to the game. Uh, especially, you know, because it's pretty in depth. Especially when you're dealing with what, eighteen players, eight or eighteen units, essentially. Yeah. Gotcha. So while we're taking this down, um, I know that Zero Bit has been on uh, the Educate and Dominate series a while back, so people kind of know this. So, uh, 
why don't you go ahead and uh, introduce yourself, TMG, to the community um, that doesn't know you from my channel and, and talk a little bit about what you do. All right, so uh, I started playing Seminars War about uh, 30 days after release uh, back with my main account. Uh, this is the alternate account that I'm on now uh, that I'm building up. But I started, and uh, when I first started, like I went, I got into a situation where I was just throwing money at the game uh, simply because I thought all you had to do in this game was make six stars and then you win. Um, so I was about 26 stars in. I was stuck at like Giants B6 like an idiot, and I didn't know why. Um, and my team sucked. Um, this was, I think I was like $2,000 in, right? And I was so frustrated with this game. And uh, it took a while because at the time when, when I started Summoner's War, uh, there wasn't really a lot of guides out to really help players, you know, move forward and basically prevent you from saving money. Um, so when I got into YouTube, uh, my main goal, this was like far after I was already autoing, you know, Dragon's Beat 10 and, you know, getting all the uh, in game content done and stuff. Uh, I did Guardian 1. Uh, I was getting close to Guardian 2, uh, and then I that was before I started the Guide to Guardian uh, series on YouTube. And uh, the, the main purpose was really uh, just to help players, you know, avoid uh, frustration and avoid spending a lot of, I wouldn't say useless money, but money that could be better well spent, <laughs> um, and, and getting them through progression. Um, and, you know, that became my main focus was, you know, to help players get through that uh, as efficiently, as effectively as possible. So that's that's what I do uh, on my YouTube channel. And, you know, that's basically the focus. And uh, we've helped a lot of players skip past a lot of the BS that Com just throws at you, especially if you don't know what's going on. Right. And then with regards to uh, the streaming aspect, do you kind of have a, an amount that you do um, in... Uh, like, do you do you have certain days that you do your streaming, um, and then do you do uh, certain days that you do your YouTube videos? How does that all go down? Uh, so typically, um, I was, uh, you know, like I slowed down last week because I was waiting for this to come out. Uh, but I, I try to post uh, at least one video every day uh, on YouTube, and then for streaming wise, I stream typically Monday to Friday, six to nine, and then on the stream side, I just do account reviews. Um, where, you know, people will come in and, you know, they'll say, hey, I need some help, and then we'll just help with general progression, um, and then I just stick within my expertise, which is, uh, for now, it's, you know, beginner all the way to Guardian 1, and then I just help people wherever they're at in their game uh, get to the next level, um, and then we just kind of do it in steps, um, kind of like, a, I guess, a Summoner's War coach, <laughs> right. essentially. Right, and I think that's the best thing the that is great to recognize is that we got a lot of YouTubers that, you know, try to provide a wide variety of content, but we have a, a good select amount of people that kind of know their realm of knowledge and, and work with the people around it. Um, you know, Rafey's a good advocate of um, helping a lot of beginners and intermediate players coming on board, but, you know, people like ZeroBet, he's been, you know, doing it for quite some time as well. He's been able to help out the mid to late game players, so it's kind of cool to see, you know, everybody, um, you know, helping when they can. Me, I don't do nothing. I just, I just pretend to act like I know what I'm doing. <laughs> but uh, so, I, it, what were you gonna say? Uh, just said you're a child. It's just some just wore news. Yeah, exactly, exactly. He's the talk show host for, <laughs> for kind. Exactly. Speaking of talk show hosts, uh, you know that was cool. You, you did some of the, some of the entertainment videos there. You know, hosting like the Comptos News and whatnot. So, you got anything in store for upcoming or whatnot or what? Yeah, uh, there's a couple of things that I've been working on in the mix. Uh, obviously, more Comp to Us news. Um, like now, it'll be <laughs> probably a bit before Comp to Us news because now I'm like all absorbed with this raid, and I know I'm not gonna have a life for I don't know how long now. And uh, some definitely some more rap battles and stuff coming for sure. Uh, there you keep go. the laughs rolling and uh, always keep it interesting. I was gonna say here. Look at like I just took a look now. I uh, apparently. You're not able to join join the raid. I sent you an invite early on, but I don't know if it went through. It's because my eyes are slanted. That's why. <laughs> yeah. Shoot. <laughs> oh I no, I know what it is because I didn't deal uh, thirty percent damage, uh, so I can't go to level two. Oh, so we gotta do level one until you can do thirty percent. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god! All right, so why don't why don't we do that? What? Because uh, this is what the 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 the, the childish plays YouTube channel is all about with regards to epic fail. So why don't you explain yourself? Why uh, g give a brief overview? Why uh, why you're not on your main account right now? All right, so uh, on my main account, I had uh, you know uh, over 46 stars, uh, some of which included Eludia, which was my first TOA clear L and D summon, uh, Eladriel, Tishar, uh, Camilla, etc. And um, 
so what had happened was I was on my my man, my manly man, my menstrual cycle. Yeah, and, menstrual uh, cycle. <laughs> And I, I don't know, I was going through like a transitional phase. A buddy of mine had just gifted me an account with Xeros and I was feeling kind of salty because, you know, I don't know what I was feeling. So I was like, uh, well, I need to make a decision, right? You know, and Alexander the Great said, you know, if you need to make a decision, you need to burn all your other bridges uh, so you can get focused. So that's what I did. And I reset my main account like, a, like an asshole. And then, uh, of course, um, so I was like, well, there's no turning back now, so now I have to focus on this new account, which is the baby account with Xeros. And uh, <laughs> I don't know what I was thinking. And of course, shortly after, that's when I found out the Rift of Worlds was coming out. So yeah, it kind of put me in a pigeonhole. Jeez. So triple Verde gone, double just soon, you know, all the good jazz. Oh my God, look at that. I just, I just, that is a fail. I spelled zero bit with a... <laughs> yeah. Oh. oh my God. So I guess what we'll have to do is... Um, uh, I don't know if uh, we have anybody online that we know that can do level three. See if you can do level three one time. Uh, let me see. Where where is zero bit at? Zero, do you got anybody in guild that 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 is available or no? Let me check. Oh man! Oh man! I tell you what, though, I ain't gonna lie. I'm pretty, uh, I'm pretty excited. I, I haven't been so excited since they introduced guild battles. Um, oh my god, dude! <laughs> let's put so. it, let's put it this way. Right now, it's eleven twenty-three, and so you know, my lifestyle as a bodybuilder, I'm eating you know six to seven times a day. I just ate my first meal ten minutes before we got on <laughs> on recording. I did. I, I, I was so into the game that I, I forgot to eat. That's bad. That is bad. All right. So while he's seeing if we can get somebody on board, uh, level three. Obviously, I don't. You you saw when you saw the people do it live. Did you see them do like level three, level four? When when I did it. Well, I don't know if you did it or if if you were watching people on the stream. You said you were doing it live there for a little bit, but you said you couldn't do it. On yeah, the uh, we. Uh, I I cut it off after we did one. Um, just mainly because I was streaming for like eight hours, and uh, yeah. So after we did World Boss and uh, we did we did level one, then we just called it. Gotcha. I'm trying to think here. I wonder because uh, <coughs> I I just did level three with a couple of guildies a while back, and we actually didn't was not able to clear it. So I'm curious, what do I need to incorporate now? Um, did the attack? I didn't even pay attention to that last fight. Did the attack bar work? Oh, add attack bar reduction work? Or yeah, no? attack bar reduction works. Everything is, is fair game except for cons damage. And, uh, yeah, cons damage doesn't work. Attack bar reduction works. Uh, I wasn't paying attention. I didn't see if you can skill reset the boss or not. Um, I saw remove cooldown pop, but uh, I don't know if it affected anything in terms of a skill bar. Right. Zero, any luck? Uh, nope. Okay. There's no way, sir. Yep. Okay. Well, I guess I guess they have this option here to to set it to public there, so we can set it to public and have yep. somebody pop up. Oh, look at that! Look at that, dude. Whoa. <laughs> okay. Okay. We got Ramagos. Ramagos is not optimal, people. <laughs> and you and you saw him put Chloe as a leader there. Okay, dude. We're, hey, get that account up. What are you doing? <laughs> TMG, man. Don't don't let me do this. I'm letting you do it. I'm. I'm. Uh, <laughs> oh man. Oh god, that's funny. Ramagos, dude. Ram <laughs> wow. All right. So we'll see. We'll see if, the, if this if this young cat Lori King can do it here. Uh, help us out. Oh, he's ready. All right. Any, and any, <laughs> anything I anything I need to change? You, you, should I keep this like this or whatever like that or what? Mm. We got immunity. We got we got the attack. Let's see. Attack break. Death break. Yeah. Oh, steady HP. I think I think we're we're good. All right, all right, that's fine. That's good. Uh, oh, you know what I didn't even think about? I 
at level three, don't, shouldn't we have? Uh, did you have any revive? Were you starting to use revive? Because I I remember level two, I started uh, losing some cats like at the very very end. Uh, below uh, fifty-five, uh, no, twenty-five percent. He actually does a great lot, a lot of damage because his damage increases uh, when he removes both, you know, buffs. Hmm. Yeah, I think so. Let me see. All right. So we're taking a look here. Some of the things that are going on: attack power and attack speed decrease on the for two turns. Oblivious state. Just just a mean guy. Just just putting all that stuff on. And then so okay. The the counter that goes up uh, for every turn that the that the units get. That's kind of that's kind of like a like a, almost like an offset to violence. Part. So if you got a violence set, you're more opt to turn that counter up. You know higher, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh man. So it's almost like, uh, obviously, no one's going to re-ruin everybody just to, to fix that, whatever, but that's kind of the, there's an upside and a downside to have a violence, that it seems. Yeah, and same thing with beneficial effects. The more the more beneficial effects you have could also be a detriment as well. Yeah. What is it? Uh, so does somebody want to tell Lockerine Loc- that uh, his Ramagos is not, is <laughs> not doing any damage? <laughs> <laughs> you can re- rotate the, the uh, camera. Yeah. We'll, we'll rotate. We'll give him a little show. <laughs> we'll, we'll give him a little show. I keep on forgetting that you can rotate. I didn't figure that out until the very end of my last video. <laughs> I was like a retard. I was just like tapping on the screen and trying to figure out why I couldn't like move it. Yeah. And somebody in stream was like, hey, man, all you got to do is swipe. I'm like, oh, yeah. Yeah. And so, and, and if I remember correctly, the leader is always in the middle and then the, the people that come on board are always here. So, like, if you were... If, if zero bit like zero bit screen looked like this, right? When he started out, he was all turned over here. And my Sigmaros just died. <laughs> uh oh. Oh yeah, and that's one thing too. Like, if any of your team members die, then the other heads will start to focus fire on another team. Yep. Okay, so can they that that stun that he does? Can he land it if we have immunity on? I know it sounds like a stupid question, but I swear, like every time he does his stun, like. My immunity just happens to be off. No, um, first turn, I was paying attention, like, when Delphoi had immunity up, we were fine. Um, and then as soon as that immunity dropped and he landed a stun, then everything would start to go to shit. Um, if the team wasn't fast enough or, or, or consistent enough to keep immunity up. So, like, immunity and negative effects are, like, honestly the key. Um, especially, I see, like, when people start doing speed clears of this, uh, being able to, uh, you know, manage that effectively and put enough damage out is going to be huge. GG. GG, I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Appar- apparently, uh, we suck at life. The- apparently, the Ramagos <laughs> is why we lost. <laughs> oh, man. All right, let's go ahead and quit this battle. Let me see. I got, I got a little, I got a little bit of my, 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 my black kind of coming into play there. You know, I didn't win, but at least I looked good losing, right? And I had myself 49 percent <laughs> damage. There you go. All right. Let's see if we can try one more time, and then we'll call the, we'll call the video right there. See if we can get lucky. I'll see if. Um, Anyone available? Let's uh, get Ramagos back. I know, right? So uh, today, now after the video, uh, TMG, what you got? What you got in store? Are you gonna be hopping on stream? Or are you gonna be making videos? What do you got going on? All of the above, man. All of the above. Uh, yeah, workload is ridiculous now <laughs> gotcha right and then so this is is this like the full-time job for you now or have you been uh, doing other uh, work elsewhere? no i i uh i bartend uh part-time at the nightclubs oh. out here in vegas uh, oh, okay. and then i do this but it's it's creeping slowly over to full-time youtube twitch so 
I'm, I'm waiting. Gotcha, gotcha. Let's see. Let's see. All right, so let's try. Let's try to do it one more time. I think Lunix has actually done. He's on level four, level five. I forget. Does anybody you know if anybody's cleared five yet? No, I have not. I got people. I I don't know who it was that was asking in our private channel online, asking if anybody's cleared five. God, I did it again. I typed zero. <laughs> I typed zero, but oh dear. I just hit up Calm about that. Uh, seeing if they can retrieve that my old account. Yeah, that'd be cool, man. If you can do that, yeah. save you a lot of time. Oh my god, dude. I I think that's what it was like. Underestimate. I'm like shit. I got zero. I'm good. Yeah. But I mean, it, I mean, it was relatively quick. I mean, on that account, on the baby account, because I already knew what to do. It was like two weeks. GB10 auto was done. And then uh, now I'm just edging into DB9. But it's just like, God damn. I forgot how long it takes to make six stars. Yeah, it takes a while, that's for sure. And so uh, so now that you, you, with this new account, were you doing, um, were you keeping it uh, free to play or are you still, you know, donate when you can? Donate when I can, of course. Yeah. The only uh, account that I kept free to play was the the account that I used for the Guide to Guardian series for YouTube, because uh, that was just you know I didn't want I wanted to create an environment where there was honestly anybody could pick up, follow, and and succeed. You know, right? Uh, so like I was like, oh yeah, you know if I pulled like <laughs> I don't know Bastet or some shit. <laughs> Do you have a defense leader? I don't. I don't. Well, I got Orion, but I mean, um. I don't know if Orion would be good here. I won't have any damage. Just just Chandra and Theo. Do you want me to put Orion in there for the six? Sure. Or, I mean, because I, I was going to do Laika, too. But Orion is a uh, universe. Uh, it's good Dude, you see, the, you see this dragging? Oh, there we go. So what do you want, Laika or, or, or Draco? So probably should Draco for the immunity? Mm-hmm. All right. And I guess... Come on, seriously, dude. There, hey, hey, all right. I'll let you guys do the damage. I'm just going to try to stay alive. How about that? Oh, man. All right. Let's see here. So I was gonna say, uh, did you did you get all set up, uh, TMG on the uh, Arena Summoners War uh, website? I did, I did. I have Good. my account and everything. Good. I'm glad because I, I ain't gonna lie. I, I I have seen a, a substantial jump in in some of the videos, views, uh, likes, and and a lot of people's um, uh, a lot of people's videos. Yeah, we uh yeah I set it up uh, a while back, like when we when I first met you, uh, I had popped on there. I set up my account then, back when I was still had control of my my baby. <laughs> yeah, it's a and it's a great story, by the way. I'm sure some people uh, saw the uh, video that you made. Uh, the video that caught my eye from you is obviously the um, you know your 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 inspirational post about you know kind of following your dreams and whatnot and doing what you got to do. Uh, definitely, definitely caught me off guard, but it was uh, quite touching, sir. So it's good to see you. You know, kind of follow that ride, and you know, sitting there from I think you were at what maybe like a hundred subscribers, something like that, in there, and now you're over three thousand. Yeah, you know, it's kind of crazy. You know, I remember because uh, there was a point in time, dude, where like because uh, like I knew I wanted to do YouTube or whatever, and I was like, uh, a point in time, like I ended up homeless, and I literally was like recording videos from my car, <laughs> like yeah. behind a fucking Starbucks, and. Uh, just to see like the progression, you know, not not just in terms of like YouTube, but well, yes, I guess in terms of YouTube from like in the back of my car to back into a place uh, streaming in a house with no furniture, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Right. From my laptop and then now full house full of furniture, you know what I mean? And like it's, I don't know, it's crazy. Um, you know, it kind of set in stone uh, the feeling that, you know, if there's anything out there that anybody wants to do, honestly, they could do it, man. Just consistent effort over time. Good deal. Wow, it looks like um, it looks like we're gonna be able to do it. Apparently, I suck when it comes to damage, but that's okay. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I guess there has to be that that balance, right? So we'll take a look at 
his setup here. See, I was using my, my Bernard. Um, I use mine uh, in, in a PvE setting more than I do PvP, so he has... He's actually rocking accuracy on, on, on 6. And I have my, my best speed rune on the 4 slot is a crit rate rune. So I have, like, no hit points on him, like 16, 17k. That's how you gotta do it, man. <laughs> yeah, but I mean, I mean, like, it sucks because I want to use it for a situation like this, but I just feel he's so, uh, so squishy. Yes, yeah, it's, it's so funny how, how different, like, PvE, PvP builds are. Yeah. For sure. Uh, I think, I think Lunix and Zero Bit's gonna carry us. <laughs> Cause I'm like, uh, Orion stole this stuff one time. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, boy. Oh, dear. Look at that. I can't even type. I suck. I suck so bad, they won't even allow me to say I suck. I just... <laughs> Maybe one day they'll give us the option to uh, remove the profanity filter. I tell you what. Yeah, so I guess I guess uh, I gotta take note on what everybody else is doing because apparently uh, my team failed. Is this? Uh, have you cleared three already? Or no, no, no. This is yeah. This is the first time. You gotta you gotta come back in and do it till you get thirty percent. Oh. Oh man. That's so brutal. <laughs> That's so brutal. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, because if you don't, if you don't contribute thirty percent, it won't unlock the next level. Gotcha, gotcha. All right. Well, I will have to get back to it um, to do it again. You know, but again, I got definitely want to thank you guys for taking the opportunity to come on board and just kind of doing this episode for us. Um, any any shout outs you want to give to the community out there? Zero bit. A shout out to my subscribers. I love you guys. <laughs> all right, all right. And what about you, TMG? Same thing, man. Shouts out to the TMG crew and uh, for everybody that made this possible. And uh, shout out to Childish. He was like the uh, first first person that was like, hey, what's up, TMG? You know what I'm saying? Kind of uh, showed me the ropes and the reins. Helped me uh, redo my uh, screenshots when I was new in the game. <laughs> oh, man. Those were the days. Those were the days. And that's what it kind of comes down to. We, uh, You know, everyone... Everyone uh, goes out of their way to help people out, and, and I, I have a, a laundry list of people that have been you know, instrumental in, in where I've gotten today. So it's good to know that we have great people like you, both of you guys that are paying it forward and doing what we got to do to uh, provide great content for the community. So thank you guys for coming on board. I appreciate it. Yeah, for sure, man. Thanks for having me. Thanks, bro. All right, guys. Well, thank you guys all for tuning in. It's a pleasure to make these videos for you, as always. It's your boy Childish, TMG, and Zero Bit with Childish Place checking out. Take care. We will see you next time, guys. We're out.